bridge. Uh, that's the thing. Also, we're at 273 degree feet. Wow. Alright, so now I'm done work and I am here in the IKEA restaurant and I'm gonna be eating this thing and this thing. Because I need food. And I'm wanting something sweet. I just realized I haven't been vlogging properly. But anyway, um, right now I am obviously at home. Uh, or it's over. Why haven't I been vlogging properly? I can see that a storm seems to be brewing outside. Wonderful. Um, and I don't know, like, I've, I'm feeling a bit weird today. I feel um, like I'm not as full of creative ideas lately as I used to be. And I have a feeling I know why. I mean, I have sort of been using the Uviver challenges as a crutch to get video ideas. And that's not very good. And as a result, then my Friday videos would end up being, uh, sort of not the best. And obviously I don't want that. Like, I want to have a high production quality, a high standard for myself and my videos. And anyway, I feel like that hasn't been carried out in the way I want it to. I mean, quality is the same, but I feel like the creativity isn't quite the same. Or maybe that's just me being harsh on myself because the last video was kind of meh. I think that's more of what it is because I have some great ideas coming up that have to do with donuts. Because here's the thing, if I set any kind of restriction for myself, I can make some pretty intense, amazing stuff. Like, I could make a video about Christmas lights, or I could make I could make a video, an interesting series about plants, or about um, this piano right here. Like literally, name anything in this room, and I can make an interesting series about it, or at least one video about it. But I think just the amount of running about and doing stuff, and not even really having a chance to properly sit down and process everything has not been very good for my creativity. Anyway, that's not gonna be much of an issue in a little bit, but I can't really say more about that yet. However, until then, I'm kind of like, ah. The good thing about that though is that it really reinforces some of the choices I made and it's like, Jonathan, yes, that was a good thing. You did a good thing, good. And I'm happy about that. Anyway, I want to call my parents now, not to talk very long, but I want to tell them about the donut thing. I've emailed them, but they didn't respond. Weirdos. This dehumidifier is so loud! Ah! What? Okay, wait, internet, please explain to me. Why are dehumidifiers so loud? Actually, I'm just gonna Google this, because I'm very curious. Like, not just a little bit curious, where I'll ask you guys stuff, and then, like, I'm content to knowing later. I feel like a teacher when I do this because not only do I gain knowledge, but you guys also gain knowledge if you didn't know this stuff already. So rather than me just privately Googling this, I am um, giving you guys mandatory readings of Wikipedia articles. Here's some fried rice. Here's some fish. Here's some Jonathan. Hi. Ooh, what's this stuff here? Yup. That's gonna happen again. Oh boy, this has been in my hair for 32 minutes. I was going for 20. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, this is annoying. I mean, it's all right, but, oh, look at that huge zit, zit. Like, look, you can see where it's like almost purplish up there. Whatever, that'll go away, but that's such a good, there's more purple. Um, but yeah, right before that is where it used to be the notoriously terrible roots, and unfortunately, using 20 volume bleach doesn't seem to be enough. Like the rest of the hair tones properly, but that part, no. No, not at all, not really, nope. I never thought I did anything, but actually the volume of bleach, like uh, if it's 30 or 40 volume, it actually makes a difference. It uh, can burn your scalp and do some really bad damage, at that point, but I think that's the only way to like lighten it properly because the tips, that's, those are 30 volume. Ugh, I gotta get to bed. Yep. Too much working on the sponsorship document. Okay, it's 3 a.m. I screwed up a little. I'm just gonna, um, I'm gonna comment on comment. I like the color of that shirt. And you wanna go to Ikea? Cool.
And you can sigh off mutility. That makes sense. And it's actually true. Wow. To use. Mutant styles. And that thing was a sunbow or a halo. Apparently it's also called the corona. And diamond dust sounds like a really cool thing. Nature's awesome, isn't it? Yeah, I agree. And YouTube thought this was spam because YouTube is dumb. But uh, this is great information. I'm gonna get going. Um, I'm not gonna post this till like later tomorrow just because of the fact that, well, it's late and I don't feel like being up for another half hour or 15 minutes or however long it takes. I wanna go to bed now. So I will see you tomorrow. Bye.